Hello, everybody. Uh, as y'all know, y'all know who I am. But, uh, but anyways, uh, it's about 8.58 a.m. Uh, Thursday, March 14th, 2024. Um, I actually meant to do this, uh, do this yesterday, but I, I got tired and, uh, I couldn't, well, I was tired when I woke up and, I didn't, but anyways, uh, y'all, uh, this is a prayer, because, like, what's gonna happen is, uh, what's gonna happen is, y'all gonna, we gonna, we gonna, at some point, we're gonna learn about, uh, the word, blood, and the spirit, or at least the all holy, all word, all blood, and our spirit of Jesus Christ, um, and how it, how it, it, it covers people, uh, how it's within people and uh how it works for people and uh and and like when it comes to women uh as even as of right now this is something that women should already be praying for uh to be honest with you especially when it comes to when it comes to like finding their true love and uh and just in general for the fact that women are beautiful, right, women are beautiful, women are sexy, right, and, like, it, it, like, when it comes to it, it needs to be prayed for so that people, men, are, so they're protected from, they're protected by Jesus from men who would be sexually deviant or look at them lustfully and, or look at them in any kind of sexually explicit way. Uh, for the things that women will wear, uh, because I mean, is some things can be revealing that women wear. That's that in in all honesty, is still okay to wear. Um, but the problem is, um, women can then be seen as <clears throat> can be seen as if they're trying to attract attention or attract men and stuff like that. So they need to pray to Jesus Christ. Um, this is something that y'all could be doing now when it comes to understanding Jesus Christ is only a man, right? Or only male. This is still something y'all could be praying for. Um, but like when it comes to y'all, when it comes to the All Holy All Daughter, this is something that y'all are going to want to be praying for, uh, so that, so that you don't attract the wrong man, especially if you are single and you are looking for love, right? And looking for true love. Uh, when it comes to that, it's, it's just, uh, it's it's something that y'all should be praying for. Uh so anyways, uh I'm gonna go ahead and pray for it. Um in order to, at least at least for the fact that it so that it's done. Uh so that it's there for uh so that it's there uh because I knew about it, right? And I was blessed to understand it. So since I'm blessed to understand, I'm gonna pray for it on record so that so that it's done, so that it's on record, so those who who would then follow me would then follow that prayer, and then could also pray the same prayer or pray a similar prayer to Jesus, um, simply because I I can't I indirectly I guess I indirectly yet then can kind of directly affect your life, um, but when it comes to it, Jesus always has your life and uh, your love, death, and life, and Jesus should then be the one follow with prayer. Uh, to be honest with you, um, cause like, cause like you can sit back here and kind of look at it. It's like Jesus is up in heaven, looking down on everybody and praying things for people. And since Jesus taught us how to pray and Jesus taught us how to communicate with God, as it's possible to communicate with God through Jesus, we're basically just following Jesus's prayers for us to heaven, right? As, as you pray, so. So, um, that's, that's the way I look at it. I hope that's not wrong. I really don't think it's wrong. Uh, and then it's, it's also something that'll continue to help you keep praying since, uh, life on earth can actually get to be so, uh, get to be so hard and then as, as suffering and struggling always, uh, exists, right? So, so anyways, um, I'm gonna go ahead and pray this prayer, uh, so that it's done just because I know, know to pray about it. And I, I, I actually, I'm gonna add in for men as well, uh, cause, uh, it's, it's definitely needed. So anyways, uh, our mother, our father, our father, our mother, our God, our God, our goddess, 
our Lord, our Lord, thou holy, our daughter and our son, and our son and our daughter, and our king and our queen, our queen and our king. Ah, uh, I'm sorry, y'all, my nose. Uh, I pray Jesus Christ, I pray Jesus. Uh, that uh, I pray within this moment of time about nine o three a.m. Thursday, March fourteenth, two thousand twenty-four. I pray that uh, I pray that your people uh, I pray that your people, especially your women, but then also your men, uh, can then be protected by the all holy, all wise, all unbiased, all praying, all perfect, all impotent, all merciful, all forgiving, all freedom, all free, our word, our blood, our spirit, our will, and our namesake. Um. When it comes to uh, when it comes to women and men being protected uh, by by how they're viewed by other by their other sisters and brothers by other people in society by their sisters and brothers by their elders by by the younger younger children as well um, I pray that how they're viewed um, what, like what was perceived on them the spirit and the word the blood and the spirit that's perceived on them. And that has created them, um, and that they then have been in likeness of Jesus Christ. Um, I pray that um, that all of our sisters and brothers can can uh, view each other as a sister and a brother, and then for um, also then for uh, their true love to then view them. Uh, in the way that they are supposed to be viewed, especially when it comes to, uh, hey, I don't know any other word for this right now. Uh, when it comes to love, uh, yeah, love. When it comes to love, and when it comes to then, uh, sexual sexuality, and and uh, sexiness. Uh, when it comes to that, um, let a sister or a brother, um, only view them as a sister or or a brother. And not as, uh, not as sexy, and not as, and not in a lustful way. Let us all view each other in such way. Um, and when we um, a, when we um, perceive another sister or brother as beautiful or handsome, um, please let it just be only that, and let it not be anything. Uh, let it not lead to anything uh, sexually immoral. Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus, I Jesus Christ, I pray in order to help uh, combat against sexual immorality between sisters and brothers in, in, in God, in Christ, in Christ Jesus. And uh, I pray, um, especially when it comes to the clothes that men and women, women and men, will, would then wear, as uh, as um, as their uh, as their sexiness could then be um appealing to another sister or brother by lust, um, it shouldn't hopefully uh by our all holy, our protecting, our perceiving, our holy, our word, our wise, our word, our blood, our spirit, our will, and our namesake. Hopefully that's protected, so therefore a sister or a brother views a sister or a brother in a sisterly or brotherly way and not in the way that their true love should actually view them, perceive them, know them. Jesus Christ, I Christ Jesus, Christ Jesus, I Jesus Christ, I pray. Uh, as I love you, you love me. You love me and I love you. As you love us all, as we all love you, as we all love you and you love us all. As everyone should love everyone in faithful likeness of your all holy, our freedom, our free, our faithful, our faith, our loving, our love, our dying, our death, and our living, our life. And I pray that everyone can uh, be in faithful likeness of your all holy, our, our wise, our unbiased, uh, yeah, our wise, our unbiased, our praying, our perfect, our impotent, our merciful, our forgiving, our freedom, our free. Our word, our blood, our spirit, our will, and our namesake, and our holy, our 16, our perspectives, and our holy, our 12, our natural, our elements, and our holy, our virtue, our virtues, our virtuous, our virtuosity, 
and our virtuousness, and our holy, our freedom, our will, our willing, our willful, and our willpower. Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, I pray to y'all holiness. Ending this prayer within the moment of time about 9.08 p.m. Thursday, March 14th, 2024. As you love us all, as we all love you, as I love you and you love me, in Jesus Christ, our Christ Jesus, I pray for your children. Amen. All right, y'all. That's, uh, that's what I got. Uh, it can probably be expanded upon, I'm sure. Um, but this it really just kind of spread a moment thing. I actually thought of this two days ago, and I wanted to do it yesterday, but I was too tired when I woke up, and so I didn't. Uh, but I did. I believe I did pray a prayer, like a smaller prayer, uh, before going to bed the night I understood it. So, what is that? Tuesday night. Tuesday night. I believe this is when I uh, is when I uh, I prayed a little prayer about it. But it wasn't as it wasn't as uh profound as this one. So so anyways, y'all, um that's that's all I got. And uh hopefully hopefully uh hopefully uh we can view each other in the right way in order for everybody to then have their true love. Because uh, that's that's all that we're that's all we kinda looking for when it comes to life here on earth. Uh Cause it's it's hard to find the person you truly love, and the only person who can get you that get you to your true love is Jesus Christ. So you gotta pray to Jesus Christ um, about your true love, cause it's like all this stuff when it comes to all this uh, knowledge that we have about finding love or finding s s someone to date and stuff like that. That needs to just completely be cut out. Um, it is good to have knowledge about this stuff, but when it comes to it, only Jesus is gonna guide you. To have your true love. Only Jesus is going to guide you to your true love. Uh, but sometimes. Sometimes. Like when it comes to the fact that sin exists. And, uh, and, and sometimes you may find. You may be with somebody. Uh, before you're actually with your actual true love. Uh, when it comes to that. Sometimes Jesus. Um, sometimes Jesus needs you to see things within sin. Uh, before actually being with your true love, because um, we all sin and we all fall short of the glory of Jesus Christ, so it's 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 something that may be necessary for you in your life. But the problem is, if you're always conscious or aware of who should of 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 understanding exactly who your true love should be, and you always asking Jesus and talking to Jesus about it, it should become a whole lot easier to understand who your true love actually is. So, um, so that's, that's really kind of all I have, y'all, and, uh, y'all, we in for, <laughs> we in for a whole lot, especially understand Jesus Christ is all holy, <laughs> we in for a whole lot, and so, and then also, well, I get to it on another video, but i see y'all in the next video, I love y'all, uh, it's 9-11 a.m., Thursday, March 14, 2024. I'll see you on this video. Bye.